in the previous episode we created the full width slider with options auto play then navigation next and previous button then pagination with default bullets and dynamic bullets and the css we applied for that pagination are background in this episode 2 we going to create the multi slider preview with different pagination options here i am added the swiper css main css then swiper js and initiate scripts now let me start the swiper swiper then swiper wrapper inside the swiper wrapper we want to create the slide image and copy and paste for other slides now i'm here i'm creating the 10 slides and we adding the paginations then navigation buttons now already html and body ready added now we are adding css for swiper and then swiper wrapper and swiper slide then we are adding for a swiper slide image we are giving height 100 percentage now we are in class for the navigation buttons now the slider with navigation option and now it will not work actually we have to initiate the pagination and navigation here now we are adding the auto play for the slides we are giving delay 2000 now we are adding navigation next element we are adding the class the same for the previous button now navigation is working here we are adding a new option loop then we are adding paginations then type here adding default uh, type bullets now so now we can with pagination uh, default uh, bullet option now we add some css for that uh, pagination bullets we are giving color crimson red see now the bullet point is crimson red actually
Now let me change that uh, bullet background uh, color active and inactive bullets. For active we are adding crimson and background inactive we are adding for white. This is the slider we created in previous episode. Now we are adding slide per view equal to 3 and changing the height to 400 pixel. Now it will look like this. Per view it is showing 3 slides. Now we are adding an another option space between. Here I am adding 10. Now I am changing the height to 200 pixel. Now it look like this. Now we are going to see the next uh, pagination option progress bar. We are adding some CSS class crimson red background. You can see that uh, top of the slider the progress bar is on. Here I will add uh, more slides. I am adding total 20 slides. Now, in the case you see that the uh, top progress bar is there. By using CSS, we can make it bottom also. Now, the another option, fraction. Now you see the, like, seventh slide of twenty, eighth of twenty. It is so like this option. And uh, the another option is custom pagination. For this custom pagination, we have to add a render bullet. In the render bullet, we are adding some JavaScript functions. Before that, we added that uh, pagination clickable. And now we are adding some classes for that custom bullet and color and background color crimson red Uh, thanks for watching. We will meet in next episode.